Hello divers and people who want to make a Christmas present to a diver. Christmas is just around the corner and if you want to make diving related Christmas presents but have no idea what to get a diver for under 100 euro, here you get the answer. My top 10 Christmas gift ideas for divers under 100 bucks, coming up. I know the problem. Christmas is approaching and loved ones keep asking me what to get me as a present without going bankrupt. I'm lucky my girlfriend is a technical diver too, but if your relatives are no divers, show him this video and don't worry about socks and ties for Christmas. And if you stepped across this video because you are no diver, I'm going to explain how you can know what pieces of gear your beloved diver already has. Oh, and by the way, you should take a beginner's class ASAP. Now, let's get into the gift ideas for your beloved diver. Number 1. The Santi Non-Heated Vest. I made a video about heating vests, you can find it in the box up. However, these vests are active heating systems and that means they heat up the diver's body using power from a battery. These systems, however, cost a couple hundred dollars. You can find out if the diver is using one of these guys by checking the suit. If the suit has a valve on the chest like this one, it's a dry suit. If the valve has some sort of cable like this, the diver already uses a heating system like this and most likely won't use the non-heated vest anyway. If he or she does not have a vest but a dry suit and dives really cold water and you don't want to break the bank, consider a non-heated vest. One of the best known and loved ones is the one from Santi, link below. The thinner BZ200 version comes at around 90 euro. The thicker and warmer BZ400 is a little bit more expensive, around 110 euro. Still, both vests make great gifts for divers using a dry suit in cold water. Number 2. The EasyCut Trilobat Line Cutter. Most divers wear this one on the belt of the harness, as you can see here, or on a wrist dive computer, or sometimes people wear it on the hose of the buoyancy compensator that looks like this. So check out if the diver already has one of these guys. If not, it makes a great Christmas gift. These things are available at around 30 to 40 euros. Number 3. Another great cutting device is the Halcyon Titanium Multi-Tool. You can check if the diver already has something like this by checking the same parts then for number 2, the belt, the hose or the wrist mounted computer. This makes a great tool because you can cut things with it, but in addition it offers two differently sized wrenches and three differently sized hexagonal allen keys and it's made from titanium, which makes it very lightweight and stainless. It comes at around 100 euros usually. Number 4. Ask the diver how he or she can note down complicated things underwater. If the diver does not mention the wet notes, you should get some for Christmas. Wet notes, like these, are small notebooks made of plastic pages, like this, and can be used to write down notes underwater. They are really handy and useful. They come in different designs, 
I got some handmade ones with my name on it for instance. However, you will find the link below to the GOE style ones that come around 50 to 60 euros. Number 5. If your diver already has some wet notes, risk a look inside. If there's nothing but the pages and a pen inside, a multi-tool like the Pandora tool for around 65 euros might make a nice gift. This thing combines over 20 tools you might use on the go for the dive gear from tightening hoses to fixing valve knobs. It's really flat, so can be carried inside the wet notes, so it's always ready even underwater. The stainless steel version comes at around 65 euros, however, they're sometimes hard to get because these things are quickly out of stock. Number 6. This is, by the way, how we show 6 on the water. Anyway, another great tool for the wet notes, especially if the diver is into cave diving, cave survey, or into scientific diving, is a survey compass. This thing is flat and can be carried in the wet notes too, and is used to create maps on the water, for instance. So check the wet notes and ask your diver if he or she can explain how to draw a map on the water. Maybe you can find out if he or she is already using something like this. If not, it's a great and relatively cheap gift that comes at around 20 euros. Number 7. Again, check the diver's dry suit for dry gloves. You recognize dry gloves because most of them, but not all, use rings like this. Some bigger, some smaller, but something like this ring. If the diver has no rings attached on the suit and is in fact diving with wet neoprene gloves, especially in the winter, a very special and nice gift might be the three finger 7mm gloves from 4th Element. Usually diving gloves have five fingers. These guys have just three fingers and are really thick. Some people find them not so handy, but they are really, really warm. So if your love diver wants to go diving in the winter in ice cold water and refuses to use dry gloves, this can be an awesome gift. You can get them for around 70 euros. Number 8. Every diver needs a compass sooner or later. While a survey compass is just useful to create maps, for instance, a normal diver's compass like this one is used to orient yourself on the water. Most divers already have a compass, but if your diver is a beginner, chances are good that he or she does not have a compass, but is going to need one soon. If you'd like to find out if the diver already has a compass, just ask him or her how she or he finds the way back to the boat or the entrance. Chances are good they will show you the compass or tell you they are in need of one. One of the best ones I ever used is the Sunto SK7. You can get this guy for around 70 to 80 euros. Link below. Number 9. A surface marker buoy is something every diver needs. To find out if your beloved diver already has one, ask how he or she can make herself or himself visible on the surface to get picked up by a boat, for instance. If the diver has one of these guys, he or she might show it to you or tell you that one of these is needed. I personally use for dives in lakes or in only calm conditions the 1 meter SMB from Halcyon that comes at around 100 euros. Depending on the environment it's used in, the diver might need a bigger one. Leave me a comment if you have further questions on SMBs. Number 10. They might look ugly, 
and maybe they fall into the category of socks and ties. Still, I never go diving without my Crocs and they make a really nice Christmas gift for divers. Crocs are just perfect if you walk around a dive boat, a dive site or a dive center and you can get in and out of them very, very quickly. That makes it the perfect shoe if you are especially a dry suit diver and want to change behind your car and stuff like that. So if your beloved diver doesn't have Crocs, get them Crocs. Crocs come at around, depending on the version, 20 to 40 bucks. Making Christmas gifts for divers that are not extremely expensive is a difficult thing. If you are a diver and have some more ideas or recommendations on Christmas gifts for divers below 100 euros slash dollars, please feel free to leave a comment and recommend other gifts if you like. If you enjoyed this content and found it helpful, subscribe to my channel, ring the bell, give me a thumbs up and watch my other videos. Merry Christmas!